This is amazing. Now we are going to see how to create AI agents in Crew AI with the power of Grok for high speed and using Llama 3. We are going to see how you can integrate your custom API with these Crew AI agents. So in this, firstly, we are going to see how to set up database, how to create API, then how to create a custom tool to integrate that with Crew AI. And finally, we are going to create AI agents. This is how the architecture is going to look like. So first, we have the data in the database. The API is going to use the data and provide that information in an endpoint. Then the custom tool in Crew AI will use that API and feed the data to Crew AI agents. We are going to create a crew for news agency, a news agency providing news about sports. So we are going to create two agents. One is the research agent. Another one is sports journalist. The research agent is going to research about the sport, the latest news, the latest score. And finally, the sports journalist is going to write an article based on the data the research agent is going to research. That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. Hi everyone, I'm really excited to show you about how to integrate your own API with Crew AI agents. We are going to create custom tool, create AI agents, create tasks and assign those tasks to those agents and finally run the crew. We are going to automate the whole process of a news agency. But before that, I regularly create videos in regards to artificial intelligence on my YouTube channel. So do subscribe and click the bell icon to stay tuned. Make sure you click the like button so this video can be helpful for many others like you. So firstly, we are going to create a database which contains information about sports data. Next, we are going to create an API which can use that data and expose the information via endpoint. This is a SQLite database which contains the list of games. And when we browse the data and we can see the team names, the game ID, the status, the home team, away team, and their scores. This database is in my same folder. Now we are going to create API using Flask. First, conda create hyphen and crew AI Python equals 3.11 and then click enter. This conda will isolate our development and it won't disturb any other projects. So next step, conda activate crew AI. Now pip install crew AI tools, Flask and request and then click enter. Now let's create a file called api.py and let's open it. Inside the file, from flask import flask request and jsonify next sqlite now we're going to initialize flask next let's create a function called get game score in there we are going to connect the nba games database that's where all the data is currently present which i showed you earlier in this way we are going to connect this flask to the database and here we are going to select the data based on the provided team name and finally, we are returning the data. That's it. That's what this function does. Connect to the database, return data based on the team name. Now next, we are going to create a, a route. This is where when you land on a URL, this data will get displayed. Next, we are going to create another route called score. That's where we get the score data. So endpoints are nothing but a URL. And finally, we are going to define the main function and run the app using app.run. That's it. Now we have created an API which can talk to a database. Now I'm going to run this code. In your terminal, Python api.py and then click enter. Now we got the API running and it's running in this URL. Now I'm going to open this and here's the response. Welcome to NBA scores API. Use score team name to fetch game scores. So this is the URL. Now I'm going to type slash score teams Lakers. By entering this endpoint, you get scores about the particular team, away team, home team, and their scores. Now we have successfully created an API. Now we are going to integrate this API with Crew AI. Let's keep this terminal running. Let's open a new terminal. In that, we are going to activate the virtual environment which we have just created, contact activate Crew AI. Next, we are going to export OpenAI API base. That is going to be Grok endpoint, this one, and then click enter. Next, export Grok API key. We mentioned OpenAI API key, but the key should be from Grok website. You can generate that from 
console.grog.com and here you can find the API key and then click enter. Next export open AI model name that is Llama 370 billion parameter model and then click enter. Now let's create a file called app.py and let's open it. Inside the file import OS, JSON, requests from crew AI, agent, task and crew. Next we need to create custom tool to integrate with API. So these are the steps which we are going to follow. First we are going to create custom tool. Next create agents then define task and then run the crew. So number one, create custom tool. From crew AI tools, import tool, add tool, game score tool. Then we are going to define a get score tool function and then providing the endpoint. That's the API endpoint. Here we are providing the description of what this tool does. Next, response using request.get. And finally, we are returning the response. That's it. We are just extracting the information from this URL or endpoint. That's where you got the score details based on the team name. Now we have created the custom tool. Next step is to create agents. We are going to create two agents. One is the research agent and sports journalist agent for a news agency. So the research agent is going to gather and analyze information on NBA game scores. And we are going to assign a tool called game score tool to the tools variable. Allow delegation is false because we are not going to make this agent give toss to other agents. Next, writer agent who is a sports journalist who is going to compose an engaging news article based on the NBA game scores. Next, step number three is define toss. First is the research task assigned to the researcher agent. Investigate the scores for the Warriors game. So that is the main task. So if you are a news agency, it could be your own game. It could be any of your latest hockey games, latest cricket game or the team name here. Next, the writer task. Write a news article about the game only with the provided information. We are providing the context as research task. So information from this is passed to the writing task and it's assigned to write region. Next step number four is to run the crew. So in the crew, we are providing agents. That's the list of agents and the list of top and that's it. Finally, we are going to run the crew by crew.kickoff and then print result. That's it. So as a quick overview, we created a custom tool to integrate crew AI with API. Next, we created two agents. One is a researcher agent, writer agent. We created tasks and assigned those tasks to those agents. And finally, we are running the crew. Now I'm going to run this code. In your terminal, Python app.py and then click enter. Now you can see the Grok API is being used. The team name is Warriors and it got the team information using the game score tool. Even in the left hand side, you can see the log of the API. The team equals Warriors is being searched by the crew AI tool. And when we go further, that information is then passed to the next sports journalist agent. And here's the title. Warriors Edge Lakers in thrilling 128-121 victory. And it gives more information. You can see this information in our database, 128-121. So that is correct. So it's clearly interacting with the API and the API is clearly interacting with the database and getting us the accurate answer. And as a final result, we got an article written based on the information provided. I'm really excited about this. I'm going to create more videos similar to this. So stay tuned. I hope you like this video. Do like, share and subscribe and thanks for watching.